Hello everyone, and welcome back to another Dante's Hearthstone video. Today what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and we're going to go ahead and pre-purchase our Whispers of the Old Guard God cards. Um, if we do this before March 21st, we'll get a special card back. And there's also rumor that we will also get um, Cthulhu for pre-purchasing these. So we're going to go ahead and purchase our packs. Got those purchased. And so now we're going to have to wait to be able to open those. Um, also, there was an announcement um, a few days ago that they are adding a new paladin um, hero to the list. And it's going to be Leodrin. And the way to get Leodrin is um, if you don't play WoW or you had played WoW, you don't have to reactivate your account. Um, all you have to do is you have to level a character from level 1 to level 20. And you'll get an achievement. For getting attuned to level 20 and when you log into Hearthstone you will have her now as a hero also they have talked about um, adding two more packs to the list um, when they add standard and wild and the standard packs will come with either TGT cards in them or they will come with classic cards. Um, the wild packs um, when purchased and opened will either contain classic cards, GVG cards, or you'll have a chance of getting um, the Curse of Naxxramas cards. Um, but an easier way to try and do that um, if you want to actually see the adventure is you can go to the Naxxramas in your solo adventures tab and as long as you purchase this first wing before Whispers of the Old Gods come out, you can still complete the entire adventure. Um, the first wing is going to cost you 700 gold, and each wing after that will be 700 gold as well. But instead of having to purchase packs to get the next Ramus cards, um, you'll also be able to enjoy the adventure. Um, by purchasing each wing and you'll be able to get the cards by completing each one of the wings um, and if you went the crafting way it would cost you a lot to craft the cards so it would be a very good idea to go ahead and purchase the first wing of Naxxramas um, to save the money on buying packs and save the dust on having to craft all those cards. Um, also they have added um, our deck count is now 18 instead of 9 which gives us more room for our deck slots. Um, another thing that they added today in fact 
is when you pick a class, doesn't matter what class, they have added recipes <clears throat> to the list where you can either make a custom deck of your own or they suggest three decks. Um, so let's go ahead and click on the handlock and it's telling me I'm missing a card. So we're going to click on the missing card and we're going to choose it. And if we click on replace card, since we don't have Sylvanas, it gives a, suge a suggestion of two other cards that we could use to replace it in this particular deck. Um, let's click on a different one here. And we're going to delete that one. We're going to click on the Warlock again. And we're going to click on the Classic Warlock. So see, it goes, go, goes ahead and it fills the whole deck. And so I have all 30 of 30 cards for this particular deck. Um, if we chose the Demon Horde, which we're missing one card, if we choose that deck, and we click on Gormok, it will suggest two other cards that we could put in place of it. So, you know, I think this is an interesting um, concept that they've added that gets people to experiment with different decks that they've either wanted to play or they've wanted to experiment with themselves, you know, themselves, but they didn't know what cards to put in it. They didn't know, you know, if they had all the cards in the deck and what they could put in in place of it. Um, so let's see, We're, we click the rogue and there's an empowered spell deck, which I know one of the cards is going to be Maligos and the other one is Pledge Mage Thalnos. So if we choose that and we click on Thalnos, it gives us the option of putting these two cards in since we don't have Thalnos. Um, and for Maligos, it gives us these two cards to replace since we don't have Maligos. Um, but it gives, it gives you an idea of how some of the decks are actually um, built. Um, it gives you the option of experimenting with other decks that you may have not played before or you've been like, well, I don't know if I have all the cards and how much dust I would need to be able to craft the cards. And as you can see, you know, I don't have Maligos, and Maligos is a legendary, so it would cost me 1600 dust. Same thing with Thalnos. So it lets us know, hey, it takes two legendaries, that's what you're missing. And we can either work on trying to craft those, or, you know, when I clicked on them, it showed us the replacements that we could put in that deck instead. Um, they've also said that um, we will get more card reveals here in the near future. Um, uh, on the Hearthstone website, it says that they will start um, revealing more of the cards on March 21st. So... We're going to wait and see what they have in store for us. And don't forget to, to click on the subscribe button and join the Dante's Hearthstone page. And we'll see you next time.